No. Nope. Thank you kindly, Twilight, for helping me out. No. I bet Big Macintosh I could get all these golden delicious in the barn by lunchtime. If I will, he's gonna walk down Stirrup Street in one of Granny's girdles. <laughs> no problem at all, Applejack. But I'm glad the goal is lunchtime. All this hard work is making me hungry. I know, right? Oh, wee, Spike. You've been lounging on my back all morning while we worked. Exactly. You two are taking so long, I miss snack time. <laughs> I guess we better get some food. Nope. Mm. Aha! Oh, Spike, that looks delicious. Spike! What? <gasps> Letter from Princess Celestia. <clears throat> hear ye, hear ye. Her Grand Royal Highness, Princess Celestia of Equestria, is pleased to announce the Grand Galloping Gala to be held in the magnificent capital city of Canterlot on the 21st day of. Uh, yada, yada, yada. Cordially extends an invitation to Twilight Sparkle plus one guest. <gasps> the, the Grand, Grand Galloping, Galloping Gala! My little pony. My little pony, ah, my little pony. I used to wonder what friendship could be. My little pony. Until you all shared its magic with me. Big adventure, tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness, it's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. I've never been to the gala. Have you, Spike? No, and I plan to keep it that way. I don't want any of that girly, frilly, frou-frou nonsense. Aw, oh, come on, Spike. A dance would be nice. Nice? It's a heap good more than just nice. I'd love to go. Land sakes! If I had an apple stand set up, ponies would be chawing our taste of it until the cows came home. Do you have any idea how much business I could drum up for Sweet Apple Acres? Why, with all that money, we could do a heap of fixing up around here. We could replace that saggy old roof. And Big Macintosh could replace that saggy old plow. And Granny Smith could replace that saggy old hip. Why, I'd give my left hind leg to go to that gala. Oh, well, in that case, would you like to... Whoa! Are we talking about the Grand Galloping Gala? Rainbow Dash, you told me you were too busy to help me harvest apples. What were you busy doing? Spying? No, I was busy napping. And I just happened to hear that you have an extra ticket. Yeah, but... Yes! This is so awesome! The Wonder Bolts perform at the Grand Galloping Gala every year. I can see it now. Everyone would be watching the sky. Their eyes are riveted on the Wonder Bolts. But then, they would fly. Rainbow Dash! <gasps> I would draw their attention with my super speed strut. <laughs> then, I would mesmerize them with my fantastic Billy Flash. And for my grand finale, the Buccaneer Blade! Wonderbolts would insist that my signature moves be incorporated into their routine. And then, welcome me as their newest member. Don't you see, Twilight? This could be my one chance to show them my stuff. You've got to take me. Uh, hold on, there's one pony picking right in here. I asked for that ticket first. So? That doesn't mean you own it. Oh, yeah? Well, I challenge you to a hoof wrestle. Winner gets the ticket. Uh, mm. Girls, these are my tickets. I'll decide who gets it, thank you very much. Whoever has the best reason to go should get the ticket, don't you think? Drumming up business for the farm? 
A chance to audition for the Wonderbolts? Money to fix Granny's hip. Living the dream! Oh my, those were all pretty good reasons, aren't they? <laughs> Listen to that. I am starving. I don't know about you, but I can't make important decisions on an empty stomach. So I'll uh, think about it over lunch and get back to you two, okay? Okay. So who are you gonna give the ticket to, Twilight? I don't know, Spike, but I really can't think straight when I'm hungry. So where should we eat? had the opportunity to attend. Oh, the society, the culture, the glamour. It's where I truly belong. <laughs> and where I'm destined to meet him. Him! Who? Him. I would stroll through the gala, and everyone would wonder, who is that mysterious man? They would never guess that I was just a simple pony from little old Ponyville. Why, I would cause such a sensation that I would be invited for an audience with Princess Celestia herself. And the princess would be so taken with the style and elegance that she would introduce me to him. Her nephew, the most handsome, eligible unicorn stallion in Canterlot. Our eyes would meet, our hearts would melt, our courtship would be magnificent. He would ask for my hope in marriage, and of course I would say, yes! We would have a royal wedding befitting a princess, which is <laughs> what I would become upon marrying him, the stallion of my dreams. Twilight, I simply cannot believe you would invite Pinkie Pie so she can party and prevent me from meeting my true love. How could you? <laughs> hey! <gasps> Angel. These are perfect. Uh, listen, guys. I haven't decided who to give the extra ticket to. You haven't? Um, excuse me, Twilight. I would just like to ask, I mean, if it would be all right, if you haven't given it to someone else. You? You want to go to the gala? Oh, no. I mean, yes, or actually, kind of. You see... It's not so much the Grand Galloping Gala as it is the wondrous private gated garden that surrounds the dance. The flowers are said to be the most beautiful and fragrant in all of Equestria for the night of the gala, and that night alone will they all be in bloom. And that's just the flora. Don't get me started on the fauna. There's loons and toucans and bitterns, oh my! Hummingbirds that can really hum, and buzzards that can really buzz. And blue jays, and red jays, and green jays, pink jays, and pink flamingos. Gee, Fluttershy, it sounds beautiful. Wait just a minute. Rainbow Dash, were you following me? No, I mean, yes, I mean, maybe. Look, it doesn't matter. I 
couldn't risk a goody four shoes like you giving that ticket away to just anybody. Wait just another minute. Applejack, were you following me too? No, I was following this one to make sure she didn't try any funny business. Still trying to take my ticket. Your ticket? But Twilight's taking me! Oh, oh, you you me. And then I said, Oatmeal, are you crazy? Oh. Girls, there's no use in arguing. But Twilight! Uh, this is my decision, and I'm gonna make it on my own. And I certainly can't think straight with all this noise. Not to mention hunger. Now go on, shoo! Oh, okay. And don't worry, I'll figure this out! Somehow. Ah, uh, Spike, what am I gonna do? All five of my best friends have really good reasons to go to the gala. Applejack or Rainbow Dash? Pinkie Pie or Fluttershy? Rarity? Oh, who should go with me? Have you made your decision? I can't decide! Twilight, he just wants to take your order. Oh, I would love a daffodil and daisy sandwich. Do you have any rubies? No? Okay, I'll have the hay fries. Extra crispy. What do you think, Spike? I think we have to try another restaurant. I mean, I like grass just fine, but would it hurt anybody to offer some gemstones? I mean about the gala and the ticket and who I should take. Oh, you're still on that? Spike, listen! How do I choose? And when I do choose, will the other four be mad at me? I mean, I could give up my ticket and give away two, but that would still leave three disappointed ponies. What if I... Ah, your food. Oh, thank you. This looks so good. I'm sure everything will be much clearer once I eat. Um, madame? Are you going to eat your food in the rain? It's not raining. What's going on? Hi there, best friend forever I've ever, ever had. Enjoying the sunny weather? Rainbow Dash, what are you doing? What do you mean? I just saw the smartest, most generous pony about to get rained on, so I thought I'd kick a hole in the clouds to keep her dry so she could dine and feast. That's all. Rainbow, you're not trying to get extra consideration for the extra ticket by doing the extra special favors, are you? Me? No, 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 of course not. Uh-huh. Seriously, i do it for any pony. <laughs> Rainbow, I am not comfortable accepting unwanted favors, so I'd appreciate it if you'd close up that rain cloud right now. Ugh, fine. That's better. Uh. Twilight, it's raining. No, really? Come with me before you catch a cold. Oops, sorry. Oh no, it's quite all right. After all, we are the best of friends, are we not? And you know what the best of friends do? Uh. Makeover! <laughs> Rarity! Ow! This really is a mistake. I mean, thank you, but. Oh, that's too tight. There! Oh, you're simply darling. Uh, yeah, it is kind of pretty, isn't it? And you! Oh, Spike, I have a dandy little outfit for the dashing gent. <laughs> oh, oh, hey! What is wrong? Oh, Spike, now you just need a hat. Ugh. I told you, I don't want any part of this girly galagunk. See you back at the library. <laughs> oh, who needs him anyway? This is all about you and how fabulous you'll look at the Grand Galloping Gala. Wait, the Grand... Oh! <gasps> and oh my goodness, what a coincidence. I happen to have an ensemble of my own that matches yours to a T. We would be the bells of the ball, you and I. Everyone would be clamoring for our attention. All eyes would be on us. And then everyone would finally know the most beautiful, most talented, most sophisticated pony in all of Equestria is Rarity the Unicorn. 
might sparkle, of course. <laughs> I see what's going on. You're just buttering me up so I give you the extra ticket. Well, it's not going to work. You're going to have to wait for my decision just like everyone else. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've been trying all day just to get some lunch. Did some pony say lunch? You've got to be kidding me. I got apple pie, apple fritters, apple tarts, apple dumplings, apple crisp, apple crumblers, and apple brown bag. Uh, the dessert, not my Annie. What do you say there, best friend? Is that a yes? No, no! I don't know who I'm giving the ticket to, and all these favors aren't making it any easier to decide. In fact, I'm less sure now than I was this morning! Ah! So, that's a maybe? Ugh, I never thought being showered with favors would be so aggravating. Shy, not you too. Oh, well, hello, Twilight. I hope you don't mind, but we're all doing a little spring cleaning for you. It's summer. Oh, well, better late than never, right? It was Angel's idea. You're not doing this for the ticket, are you? Oh, no. I'm doing this because you're my very best friend. Right, Angel? Oh, Yes, we are just doing this for the ticket. No, no, no! Well, this is all very nice of you and Angel, but I am not accepting any extra favors until I've made my final decision. So I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Surprise! Surprise! Twilight is my bestest friend, Luffy. Luffy, she's the cutest, smartest, all-around best pony. Pony, Pinky. I bet if I throw a super duper fun party, party, Pinky. she'll give her extra ticket to the gala to me. Yes, Twilight? At least the other ponies tried to be subtle about the ticket. Wait, what ticket? What gala? Oh, you didn't know? Twilight has an extra ticket to the Grand Galloping Gala! The Grand Galloping Gala! I ever told you how much I love your name? I wash your dishes. Would you like any help with your gardening? I have a cartload of extra carrots. I'll paint your car. I love to paint your cars. Cars. What are we gonna do? We're gonna... so much pressure on you. And if it helps, I don't want the ticket anymore. You can give it to some pony else. I won't feel bad, I promise. Me too. I feel just awful that I made you feel so awful. And me too. It's no fun upsetting your friends. Twilight, it was unfair of me to try to force you as I did. Yes! That means the ticket is mine! <laughs> I got the ticket! I got the ticket! You know, I haven't perfected my signature moves for the Wonder Bolts anyway. I don't need that ticket either. We all got so gung-ho about going to the gala that we couldn't see how un-gung-ho we were making you. We're sorry, Twilight. Spike, take down a note. Dear Princess Celestia, I've learned that one of the joys of friendship is sharing your blessings. But when there's not enough blessings to go around, having more than your friends can make you feel pretty awful. 
So, though I appreciate the invitation, I will be returning both tickets to the Grand Galloping Gala. What? If my friends can't all go, I don't want to go either. Twilight, you don't have to do that. Nope, I've made up my mind. Spike, you can send the letter now. Now you won't get to go to the gala either. It's okay, girls. I couldn't possibly enjoy myself without my best friends there with me. <laughs> so I would rather not go at all. Well, wallop my wither, Spike. Isn't that just like a boy? Can't handle the least bit of sentiment. Whoa, Nelly! A letter from the princess? That was fast. My faithful student, Twilight. Why didn't you just say so in the first place? Six tickets to the Grand Galloping Gala! Oh! Now we can all go! Yeah! 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 <laughs> Allow us to treat you to dinner. What a great way to apologize! And to celebrate! Come on, everyone! The cupcakes are on me! How come I don't get a ticket to the gala? And one for you, Spike. <laughs> I mean, gross! I have to go, too? <laughs> 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 <laughs>